universe, spirit, God, holy angels. Please let me read these readings accurately, officially, and quickly in you. I trust. Amen. People need to be watching out for people. Especially people. Stop messing with people because you don't really know what they into. Crash the fuck up. I say this. Somebody unbalanced. Capricorn talks of Virgo. I'm not, so I know that the hell ain't it. Let's see the energy. Mm. Damn, they flipped straight out. I don't know if the camera put that. But uh, everything is reversed besides one thing. Flat, past, present, and future. Bottom of the deck is closing up some type of cycle. Yes, indeed. King of Cups. Somebody offer somebody a empty cup of love. Cancer Scorpio Pisces. There's no new beginning for somebody in their present energy. There's no gift from the divine. I don't know why. What happened? And in the future is lies, pain, and heartbreak. Somebody was hurting somebody, and that's why this is going on. Mm. We got Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Mm. Page of Pentacles, Reverse. For the past. What is the energy surrounding this read at this time, please? What is the energy surrounding this read? Yeah, closing off a cycle. Somebody got a close up, like rebirth. Somebody got a close. Yeah, somebody is coming up out of thinking about something they lost with their emotions. Scorpio Pisces, Cancer, bottom of the deck. Ugh. Aries, reverse. I don't see no fire signs in this reading right now, but. I'm not done. What is the energy surrounding this weed at this time? Oh, okay, one car. Somebody staying to their self. Keeping their money to their self. Keeping secrets to their self. That's the way to go, Capricorn. Yeah. Somebody is hiding from somebody. Stalking somebody. Their emotions intact, but they literally stalking somebody. Watching somebody every move. Yeah, the Ace of Cups. For the present, somebody got a new beginning and, and some type of love that may be coming to them. Divinely guided. Somebody has had a felt victory as well with a Leo Sagittarius of Aries. So, mm, I want to see. Somebody is coming up out of sabotaging their own selves. They coming out that state. What is the energy surrounding the Five of Cups and the Three of Swords? Yeah, somebody had a fell victory um, with somebody. Yeah. With a Leo Sagittarius Aries. Don't have to be. But it was a fell engagement, union, marriage that brought some hurt. And somebody coming up out of that loss. It seemed like the divine gave you a cup of emotion, but your mind still was on that loss that you had. You ain't even pay that no mind. Yeah, Empress, Taurus, Capricorn, or Libra, yeah. Or somebody might have that felt victory with a Taurus, uh, a Capricorn, or Libra. Somebody could be stressing. Maybe their heart could be hurt. Because this empress is happy. This is somebody that's self-sabotaging. They feel like they can't move, can't see. Like, King of Pentacles out here again. This is somebody that's mad. Somebody got patience. Somebody see a happy life. Somebody not making... Somebody somebody see a happy life. Ten of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. Somebody got patience. Somebody not making no movement yet. Cancer Energy. So, me, personally, I see somebody is watching you. Could be a Virgo. I feel as though somebody is watching you from the past. 
somebody you close a cycle out with, that you had a fell victim with, with, somebody that may even had you in a third party situation, and they starting to come up out of feeling like something they lost, like they coming up out of the energy. Like for you, if you were single for a long time, this person never left your energy at all. Like the empress is here. They see you as beautiful. They see you, maybe you was pregnant by this person. They see you with your into. You got a high intuition, so you may know who this is, or maybe a couple people. But they see a happy home with you, and they trying to be patient. I think they want to make cut, make a move, and come towards you. You could be dealing with an Aries. You could be dealing with a Taurus. You could be dealing with a Capricorn as well as yourself. Well, I'm a Capricorn. This ain't a Capricorn reading, but you could be dealing with a Capricorn. A Capricorn in here though. But somebody's stalking you. And they've been going on for a while. You don't even realize it. What is the energy over this reading? Yeah, like somebody's literally stalking you. Yes, they got they have patience. They waiting though for something. You got strength for this situation though. You had strength for something. Could have been dealing with Aaliyah. But yeah, somebody is stalking you, like. Like you you coming up out of burdens. Like this person maybe was a burden to you. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to get in the shadows and see what's going on with this person. Because it's like weird. They It's like they could have been stalking you for like a year. Like a whole year. Like, I don't know, it sounds crazy, but they've been stalking you, watching you. Every little thing you do. It's not a year. It's like maybe six months. Somebody that had a fell victory with you. You closed that cycle. They didn't. And it's just like, ugh. Somebody hold it on to your energy. Like, I don't like that shit. You had strength for that situation. That situation probably put you a lot of, a lot of drama. Emotionally. And they want to come in. Slow. But they, right now, they ain't making no moves. They just watching. Like a fucking stalker. Two card, let me make sure all these is turned. Yeah. One card came out. The first one says, I scared myself that day. Like, honestly, when every time I see this card, like for real, I feel as though this is somebody that was about to do something that's trying to harm you. Like, they was going to do something to try to harm you, and they scared their self, and they had to snap out of it. Like, what the fuck am I thinking about doing? Somebody may may want to kidnap you or something. This is somebody that's literally watching you, and I don't like that. Like, their emotions intact, but they still a stalker. Or they think their emotions intact. Like, they acting like they are. And the divine know they not. The, 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 like, God is giving them a cup of love. They don't even see that shit. Their mind is on whatever. You're so easy to see through. This is how they may be looking at you. Like, this right here is like a weirdo situation. I, uh, I don't know. I, I don't like weirdo situations. Because... They don't never go right. And it's like somebody that's in your energy. Like, they could literally be riding by your house every day. You probably driving somewhere and don't even notice that they've been following you for like a couple months. I'm telling you. You got to be careful. Because this is somebody that think their emotions is intact, but the fuck they really not. Because the divine trying to give them a couple of love. They don't want that. They want you. Peace, light, and blessings.